rainfall patterns have become unpredictable the world over. In spite of the changing climatic conditions, a lot of water still goes to waste through surface runoff into lakes and oceans. These extreme weather conditions are not left out as it highlights the massive task the country faces in conserving the environment. And if we look around, we are cutting down all the trees. Look at your compound. No Dr. Richard Amankwakufo, okay. a senior lecturer at the Faculty of Science and Environmental Education. He and his colleagues are on a tree planting mission in schools and communities. We don't care about the environment. People are cutting trees here and there. People are destroying the vegetation and also compacting the soil. As a result of that, when it rains, the runoff water, all the water, the rain water, will turn into runoff water into streams and rivers and then into the sea without getting time to percolate into the soil to join the groundwater because the soil is compacted. All this is because we have destroyed the vegetation on the trees, which will help to increase the porosity of the soil. Ghana may face the same challenge as South African city of Cape Town. Dr. Emmanuel Date is dean at the Faculty of Science and Environmental Education. In the next 10 years, if we are not careful, we've heard what is happening in Cape Town, in South Africa. We, we may have to face the same challenge. People will have to queue for water and buy water. That's what is likely to happen. If we don't plant trees to actually forestall uh, this situation. The Mampo Municipal Assembly says it is committed to enforcing bylaws to protect the environment. Charles Aseidu is Municipal Environmental Health Director. We are actually really prepared to enforce the laws. But the few challenges we have is concerning uh, when matters rise up that we have to forward them to the court. You see that our opinion leaders, very respect, respectable opinion leaders, will come in and intervene on behalf of such people and that is why we are pleading that it has come to a time that we need all and sundry to give their support to the municipal assembly to enforce our bylaws. Students were taken through basic tree planting lessons during the exercise. Mahmoud Mohamed Nuruddin reporting.